Hey guys, it's Natalie here with Risen Legacy. I am um, going to do a set of uh, acrylic nails on myself today. Um, I wanted y'all to be able to just kind of watch me and see how I do my own and know that I do do my own. So um, I am going to just kind of play around. I'm going to use a couple different colors. Um, the one that I have picked out is Party Punch. Um, Party Punch. And Pink Flamingo for the... Um, pink sparkles on top. Uh, I was going to do a, a set for Valentine's Day. So I may add a couple more colors and then um, some cute little fun things in there that I may decide to um, add for free if you purchase um, all of these colors that I use at once um, for your set of nails. So uh, I hope you enjoy. Just have fun watching me and uh, if you have any questions just comment or email me at support at risenlegacy.com and I will get right back with you. So thank you for watching. Bye-bye. Okay, y'all. So I'm going to try my best to stay in the camera for you. It's a little bit uh, difficult to do it on yourself. Um, or It's different. It's not difficult. It's different instead of having the hands out in front of you versus um, right up here on you. So I will try my best to keep it in focus for, for you ladies. Um... I don't really know the style that I'm going to do just yet. I'm just going to kind of do it and go with it. So I hope to add these colors together for you so you can kind of see um, the different pigments of the pinks and uh, have a pretty set for Valentine's. So let's get started. Um, the first thing you're going to want to do is um, take my nail cleanser and wipe your nails off. You want to get all the um, oils and the filing debris off. So I have already done that. I have um, filed and shaped my nails. I am going to be using my uh, Risen Legacy Monomer. This is nail monomer that you actually have to use a brush with um, and shape shape on your nails. Um, you, can, you can use these colors for dipping. I can um, do a video and show you, or I'll do a nail actually um, dipping it and show you what it looks like um, with these combinations. So um, I've cleaned my nails and I'm fixing to do an application I'm going to open up my colors. I have Party Punch, which is kind of a shimmery pink. Um, I grabbed Pink Agate. It's pretty. I may try to do like an ombre nail. And then um, Pink Flamingo is a beautiful um, kind of pinkish glitter. <laughs> that was like $5. Um, it's, a, it's a beautiful hot pink glitter, but it kind of has like a purple hue to it. If you look at it in the light... Um, at the right angle so um dust off what I spilt I'm gonna open these up I grabbed one that was sealed already so let me open that for you they should all come sealed for y'all sealed for your protection so um okay Oh, I got a little um, ball of party punch. I'm going to put it on my nail. To use the acrylic or the monomer, it is um, it is definitely more difficult than... I don't know if y'all can see me. Let me see. It is more difficult than just dipping. Um, more for like nail salons. But you can... If you were artsy, you can conquer this. such a pretty pink so I'm gonna do that do any of you ladies have plans for Valentine's Day yet I know it's a little early you go into Walmart and they already have all their Valentine's stuff out it just it excites me this is one of my favorite holidays they put it up here a little bit Okay, so there's my pink punch. I'm going to let that dry before I add anything else. Um, I am going to do some fun things with my party nail, so I'm going to skip it. And I am going to try, not try, I'm going to do a ombre on my middle finger using the party punch and the pink agate. Um, let's fade 
into the light. So I'm gonna get a bead of my party punch, my monomer. I don't look retarded. My fingers up in my face. I'm trying so hard to show you guys. Okay, so there's a bead of the pink party. Party punch, my bad. Then I'm going to take a, a little bead of the pink agate. I'm going to put it at the tip. I'm going to pat it down. It's all about shaping, ladies. And you just kind of brush, lightly brush stroke that forward and blend it. So far that is the look. I'm going to take some party punch again, add just a little bit more at the apex. Build that apex up. The apex is um, where your nail will typically break uh, if, you, if you hit it kind of where the bending section uh, where your nail cuticle kind of starts and um, your fingernail starts to grow out so you want to build that apex up so I'm gonna take I don't know if you can kind of see that oh there we go get a little bit more pink agate blend that just a little bit I need a little bit uh, thicker this pink agate is beautiful y'all I'm just slightly blending that. Something I do want you ladies to know is um, all my products are temperature sensitive. If you are having trouble with like your um, dipping set with your um, air dry top coat drying quickly, uh, ladies, you may want to heat or not heat, warm up um, the liquids that come in the pack. Um, there's my ombre with uh, party punch and pink agate going down. Um, the the liquids perform better when they are room temperature. So um, if you need to, if you're like a cold-blooded person or if you need to um, warm them up, I suggest using, um, I had a client tell me that using a uh, heating pad was wonderful to heat up uh, the liquids in the bottles. You don't want to put them in the microwave or anything like that. You just want them room temperature. They do perform much, much better and uh, your top coat will dry much faster if they are room temperature and warm up. So if your hands are cold, you may want to kind of rub them together, warm them up, um, warm them up a little bit before you go to do your set. Same thing with the monomer. So there is a really pretty ombre. Um, I'm going to go back to my pinky and add just another little coat of the party punch, and then I'm going to add my pink flamingo on top of it. Can you see me? <laughs> I should scoot back a little bit. There we go. I know you guys are probably wanting to see what I'm doing with the monomer. Um, I just don't have enough hands here to help me move my camera down to show you. 
So I'm getting my pink flamingo. I'm going to get just a small bead of it. I'm going to set that on top. This will be a beautiful mixture for a dip set. This um, pink agate or the party punch with the pink flamingo on top. I have named all my colors. Um, putting them in categories. Trying to make it fun for you ladies. And all my colors are custom made. I make them uh, from scratch so that nobody will be able to copy any of my colors. So there is Party Punch with Pink Flamingo on top. So that we have our ombre and stuff. Um, on, I did a, I did a sample nail a while ago. I don't have a, um, a clear coat on top, but I was just different things. Um, and I have some of these cute uh, confetti things and some hearts for Valentine's Day. So, um, I possibly may add these into um, your order if you purchase um, all these powders together. So, I'll put a discount on that on um, on the website. So, um, they do kind of stick up, so they're a little better with using monomer products because you can cover them up with that uh, top coat of clear. Um, you can make it just a little bit thicker and cover that up, but um, that, that should work just fine with some dip. And then um, you may have to put just an extra coat of the of the clear, pure diamond on top, just to cover up some of those confetti. So let's go to this next finger. Um, I'm just gonna do a party punch. I love this song with Carrie Under, how great that art. I don't own any rights to this music. I just love Christian music, so I always have it on. It's so cute. My little girls know every single song. They'll just sing their little hearts out. It's so sweet. So pure. Faith, faith Like a Child is just wonderful. If there's anything you ladies would like to know about my business, my company, any information like that, please feel free to ask me. I want you to ask me. I'm so excited about um, Risen Legacy being what it is. It's a dream come true, so um, please ask me any questions. I have such a passion for nails, nail stuff, you know. Um, this is the main goal in my life. I really wanted to get something out there for you ladies to be able to do, have fun and do stuff at, at home all by yourself. And it not be so expensive, you know, and be able to fix it when you want, change it when you want. Because if you're like me, I see all my colors over here and I want to change them weekly. So um, it's a bad habit. It's a bad, it's a very wonderful but bad hobby. And I'm so sorry that I have so many beautiful colors to choose from. But you're welcome. So, um, I may do a pink agate on my thumb. Here's these so far. Got my bead, set it down, wipe off excess uh, monomer so that it doesn't just run. On the monomer, ladies, you just want enough to um, help you form and smoothen out the acrylic. It's, it's a ratio that you kind of have to figure out yourself uh, when doing it. Everyone has their own preference, but... So 
this pink agate. You don't want so much liquid that when you set it on there, it's just gonna drain sideways and you're constantly catching. But you want enough to be able to maneuver the acrylic around and set it where you want it. Remember, you don't want it on the side of your nails. That kind of opens an area for air pockets. I always set some on the end to make my tip a little bit thicker. I am going to do my other hand, but I'm going to do it on a different video just so it's not so long and I'll separate it because I'll probably do something different, a little bit different on that hand, but I don't want this video to be so long it takes forever to upload and for y'all to watch. I'm so sorry about my voice. I feel perfectly normal. I just woke up and don't have a voice. I think that's great. This is what I plan on doing today, so I still need to do it because you don't I don't want to break these. It's the worst. Let's see. I'm gonna put one of my hearts in this. up one of those it's just one of these you kind of want to um, add these little designs while the um, acrylic is still wet so that it will dry in it and add some of my um, I don't know if you can see them confetti strips it adds depth to it is to the nails See that? Oh, I'm getting some more. Just kind of setting, setting them on there right now while it, while the acrylic is wet. I'll let those dry and then I will cap it in clear. That's kind of what it looks like. So these other little hearts in there too that are cute, and I'll add one of those mm. to the side. Actually, I don't like that, so I just took that off. <clears throat> anyway, there's the thumb. I'm going to do the party nail now, and I'm going to do it in um, the party punch. Set my bead down and put it where I want it. Getting as close to your skin as possible, but not on your skin.
These are gorgeous, y'all. Some of you are probably asking how I do my other hand. I really don't know. I can't tell you that. But I actually do it better than using my dominant hand on the opposite one. So it's kind of weird. But they always end up looking so much prettier. I'm sorry. I just keep getting closer and closer. I have to add more monomer in my dampened dish. Just a minute. A monomer is, um, does have the violet stuff, um, the violet color. It does have the inhibitors in it for your nail not to, um, turn yellow when tanning. I'm putting the pink flamingo on my pointer. I'm all about the glitter. Go big or go home, right ladies? How many of you would, it's kind of been on the back of my mind, um, be interested in me doing like a, well, I was really thinking about doing like a subscription box, uh, giving you ladies a chance to see all my colors. So here's my thumb, um, my party nail. Do any of you ladies have plans for Valentine's Day? I don't as of yet. Um, it would be cool to comment and see what you ladies, what your favorite gift from Christmas was. Um, I know what mine is, is I, my husband got me some beautiful diamond earrings and then the beautiful necklace to match. So. I am sparkling and shining. So I just put added a heart. I'm going to do another one, I think. Just kind of set it on there where you want it. I'm going to put one of the little small, oh yeah, so I'm going to do that and then I'm going to cap it in clear. Um, so, y'all don't sit here and watch me forever cap and clear. I'm going to pause this real quick, cap them, and then I will get back on here and kind of show you what I've done. So, here's what we have so far. This is uh, Party Punch with Pink Agate and um, Pink Flamingo. So, uh, give me just a minute. I'll put the clear on and then I'll be right back on here. <laughs> 